You know, I'm, I'm Mike Garcia, right? Mm. Uh, that's that's who I am, and my my principles and and my my opinions on issues align with the Republican Party. So, yeah. as a, as a Republican, that that's how we define our boundary layers. And uh, but but yeah, smaller government, hard work. Um, Should there be a social safety net? Do you believe in that? Uh, I believe in social security for sure. What about um, food stamps? Uh, food stamps at a low level, I think, is um, you know, as a purist, I would say no. Everyone should should have to figure out how to fend for themselves. Medicare. Uh, Medicare at some levels, yes, uh, as well. Medicaid. Um, uh, again, I have to look at the level of that. I'm not a big fan of that. Um, uh, social security is not one of those things though right mm -hmm. social security is absolutely something we need to protect those are investments that we as as citizens have invested in mm -hmm. um, we've put that money in and that's a contract with the government that needs to be maintained um, I do understand that people get on hard times um, here, here's where I land on all of these on, on all the the programs mm -hmm. um, there should be safety nets okay but I don't want the federal government to be the safety net Right. Um, I want the churches. I want the local community, nonprofits. I want our neighbors um, to be the safety nets because a dollar that's spent at the federal government level on food stamps, by the time it gets to the level where someone's actually, you know, using those stamps and, and getting merchandise as a result of that, the inefficiency loss through that whole process is staggering. Right. So. Um, there's there's organizations like like the local veterans collaborative group sure. out here yeah. that you know I know that when we put money into that mm -hmm. that money goes it pivots right away into someone who needs that safety net right um,